Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. So today, a review of a knife that I really like the original. I don't have the original, but I really like that style. That's my favorite style of knife. I think this is the most beautiful knife ever. And so when I saw that 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 copy, I took one because I was I was wanted to get one and to see. I mean, if they do another one well made, I had some uh, Falknifen copy very well made recently, and I was thinking this one is at the level, but unfortunately it is not. So let's look at we are, what we have in detail. So we have a clone of the a copy of the Falknifen Odin with a shitty, it's not well printed. It, it, it's wrong, I'm not good quality. You have a poor laser quality handle. I was oiling it several times. I spent uh, one hour to oil it a few weeks ago. And you see it still like doesn't look very well, very well made. It's pretty thin, it's not very nice. Adjustments are not perfect. Uh, they say this is VG10, but I understand this is more like 9 cr 18 move. So not the same quality as pretended, even if 9 cr 18 move uh, still is not bad. Then you have that stuff, you can probably uh, unscrew it and change the stuff if you want. But whatever, that's still, uh, for the price I paid that, I think it was 80 bucks um, or 70 bucks. It's not bad. It's not bad. It's still an efficient knife that you can really use on the ground. Uh, it's not moving, it's it's okay, the laser is comfortable, even it's not super looking good. The sheath no, so the sheath is uh, is not good. The sheath is looks very cheap in hand, fake laser. Uh, you still have the same stuff that they do in uh, in Falkniffen, but I have the other, other copy, very well made, and this one is a bit, I'm disappointed. Let's say I'm disappointed, I would not advise you to buy that stuff. If you want, I want to show you a very good clone I have from the Falkniffen Odin that I got from the past in this EFC3, which is a good steel. And that stuff is amazing. So that stuff, I, I have it for years now. I have done a video and that's very strong, very durable. Uh, it's thicker. Everything is better. It's D553. Look at the difference in under. I mean, yeah, even the under is more comfortable. So that stuff is, is I don't know, yeah. Looks a bit a bit better. So that one is, is one stuff which was a bit more expensive. I paid that for the 130 euro. And you see, even the, the, the blade is a bit bigger. And yeah, the knife looks more more strong, more reliable. That's one of my favorite knife. Even the handle, you see. The, the guard is, is like that, which is not the same as the same style. But that, that was a very, very good clone. This is not signed. I prefer that. I prefer to do a knife, which is like inspiration, not signed, but they do a nice knife that they do a shit stuff, like that. Not shit, but okay for the point. And the, 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 what do you call that? The sheath was amazing too. Very strong laser sheath, very nice, very reliable. I mean, I never had an issue with that knife and I have it for years, years. And this is really one I like, honestly. Really well made, really good, perfect. That stuff, if they do another version, look, Perfect. The, 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 the loop is not here in the middle. The loop is here because this is why you secure the stuff. After it's moving too much. Here, it doesn't move. cannot get on. So that, that's super well made. And you have a nice bed loop. So that stuff was amazing. Unfortunately, not available anymore. I don't think so. I hope they will do another one. If they do another one, I will take it again. Forget you. But whatever. Let's look at the spec of that stuff now, uh, which, which is less good. So what the blade is, 18 a bit more than 18, 18.5 almost, 19.5 to the under. The overall length of the knife is, because I forgot that, is 31.5. Then you have thickness. Yeah, 5.5 millimeters. And the weight, 360 grams. So, uh, I mean, that's still a decent stuff, huh? honestly, that, that uh, I don't want to speak too much on them. Huh? But yeah, I'm disappointed because when you see the pictures, you're like, wow, VG10, blah, blah. But in fact, no, this is not the good stuff. I mean, if you buy fake, you buy fake and whatever. So that, that's not the perfect stuff. That, that yeah. That's all I can tell you on that stuff today. See you guys. Bye-bye.